Hello everyone and welcome to our Japanese Mini Talk channel. In our video today, we'll be discussing how to get affordable Japanese Mini Trucks. How do you buy vehicles? Do you just go to the internet and scroll through online motor bazaars and buy the vehicle? Or do you do your research on the vehicle that you're getting first and then test drive it before buying it? In this guide, we'll be focusing our attention on buying Japanese mini trucks, otherwise known as K-trucks locally in Japan. These vehicles have stood the test of time and are very reliable in different scenarios. They could be used for pretty much anything, ranging from construction to carrying farm produce. These vehicles are relatively affordable as compared to standard pickup trucks. But you will not always get these vehicles cheaply. Some sell them for a premium. In this guide, we will look at how to get affordable Japanese mini trucks. This guide should help you save tons of money in the process and get a good vehicle. You will also realize that many people have been losing a lot of money in the process of buying a new vehicle. So, you can use these tricks and strategies to save more and get a good vehicle in the process. The first thing to keep in mind is to have a budget. One of the big mistakes that many people make when they are buying a vehicle is to fail to make a budget. You do not just walk to a showroom or a sales yard and start shopping for a vehicle. When you want to buy a used Japanese mini truck, you first have to make a budget. Know how much you want to spend on the vehicle. This will avoid you overspending. This is the first way that you can get an affordable Japanese mini truck. Secondly, you should always bargain. In the United States, only second-hand Japanese mini trucks are allowed to be used. This is as per the federal law against importation of new vehicles under this class. The used cars come with an advantage over brand new vehicles. This is because you will have a chance to bargain and negotiate the price to suit your budget. Even if you are importing the vehicle, you can always use applications such as Skype to negotiate for the price of the vehicle. Lastly, you should consider importing. Importation of a used Japanese mini truck is very easy. Importing a vehicle is not how it used to be a decade ago. With the technological advancement and internet, you can have the vehicle that you want in no time. One of the reasons why importing will get you an affordable Japanese mini truck is simply because you are cutting off the midman. You get the vehicle that you want from a Japanese yard and that is the best way that you can do it. You may have to do a little paperwork, but that is normal and it will not take you a lot of time. We however recommend that you see the legal requirements of your state or country before deciding on this option. This is to avoid any shortcomings such as having the vehicle impounded. And this brings us to the end of our video today. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in our next video.